Hello, everyone. Um, I just want to get on here really quickly and share this message. Um, I thank the Lord for... Well, let me start by saying this. I am not one who gets into politics. I I could... I, I'm, I'm, I'm not that person. I'm not going to argue with you about this person. That I'm just not that person. Um, but what is concerning me is the deception that I'm seeing believers are falling into during this political season. Um, and one thing I'm grateful for is the word of the Lord. I'm grateful for the power of the Bible, the understanding that we have in the Bible. I'm grateful that the Lord gave us such a wonderful tool to guide and lead and direct our lives, as well as a wonderful tool for us to be able to discern the times of the seasons that we are in. And one thing I'm recognizing is that a lot of believers are being deceived into thinking that Donald Trump is the Antichrist. And like I said, I'm not going to be on here long. Um, I don't desire to argue with anybody about it. I desire that you open your word and begin to seek out things for yourself as Acts 17 says to become a Berean and study what the word says and, and the importance of the revelation behind the word. And so um, I just want to start by saying there are biblical prophecies that have to be fulfilled before the Antichrist appears on earth. Those biblical prophecies have yet to be fulfilled. I also want to let you uh, let you guys know that the Bible is told from a Middle Eastern perspective. So to assume that an, a, a white American man is going to appear to be the Antichrist or is the Antichrist is an ignorant statement. It's um, it's not accurate. Um, I encourage you to read Matthew 24 that will tell you some of the things to look out for when the Antichrist is going to appear. Um, I encourage you to study your Bible above all else. I encourage you to ask the Holy Spirit to give you wisdom, revelation, and understanding as you study your Bible because Trump is not the Antichrist. Like I said, there are several biblical prophecies that have to come to pass before the Antichrist appears. appears. And one of them is the rapture of the church. Like the church has to be taken up before the Antichrist appears. We're all still here. You know what I mean? Like... We are all still here. So be encouraged. I'm not on here to tell you who to vote for, who not to vote for. I'm here to let you know that Trump is not the Antichrist. Um, and the Antichrist has yet to be revealed. So be blessed. Read your Bible. Ask the Holy Spirit to lead God and direct you in wisdom, revelation, and understanding. And be diligent in what you are taking in and holding to. Um during this time, because this is a very crucial time for America. Um, so that's it. Enjoy your day. Bye.